Hello, everybody, and uh, today I am I got something in the mail. I'm not doing a box opening because I already opened it because I wanted to see it so badly. But I got the new, relatively, Haunted Bookshop cake. So this is it, and uh, I used up the last of my Haunted Bookshop um, about a month ago, something like that, um, the ribbon cut. And so went to shop for replacement and all I found was the cake online so I'm gonna open it and um, see how it compares if I like it or not it took me I would say it took me about six months to go through my last 10 of haunted bookshop and that was the you know the ribbon cut version so here we go the grand opening the lid is off and the thing is gonna pop there it goes pop it and there it is Cornell and Deal vintage blends what we got? We got the little cover thing. There's one puck, two puck. Oh, and there it is. It's a pretty tight little plug thing there, little cake. So, well, it looks the same, except for being in a cake. And it smells very raisiny. Yep, I can smell that nice. I think that's when you smell the raisins. I think that's Virginia. And there's the grass kind of going on here, but I know this is mostly burly, but I'm not really sure what burly smells like exactly. But that's what I usually like about it. So I got a square in here, and then there's these two little triangles. Kind of interesting. That, like they gave me another little tiny plug, which they've been doing on these cakes, a little tiny cake. And they gave me two triangles, so I got one of the triangles out and I'm putting it in my little sorter to sort the backy out. And I'm going to take the other triangle and blast it to pieces and pack my pipe with those. It's a little moist. So just a tad moist. That's fine. I don't tend to dry my tobacco too much because, um, I don't know, I just like to, I did, I tried it a little bit one time a bunch of times and you know i didn't really find that it helped all that much to dry it so i used the three pack method one little pack there another and then the baby mommy daddy style of compression so the first pinch you put in you just compress it very gently like a baby would press on it and then the second one, you can press a little harder, like mom. Um, and the last one is like dad, just like, Arr. and then I'm adding a little more. This is grandpa to the top. So there we go. It looks packed. It looks perfect. Now, the other thing I got here, I ordered this from Country Squire, by the way. And the other thing I got, this is an idea that Paladin Piper gave me. I was just about out of my matches. I was using just regular diamond matches, so. Um, but um, I bought some cricket matches from Country Squire, as well as the Haunted Bookshop cake. So I'm going to try these crickets and see how they do. Yeah, definitely no smell of sulfur. They're supposed to be sulfur-free. You know what? This is such a long match. I'm gonna just go ahead and do the false light, and then I'm gonna tap, tamp it down a little bit. And oh, the match went out. Con found it. Have to use another match. So it's match number two. Okay. This is just like Haunted Bookshop, the non-cake version. So good. I'm going to enjoy this. Um, you know, it's a, it's a blend I've missed even in the four or five weeks that I, since I used it last, maybe less than that, maybe like three weeks. It's a blend I like to use in the autumn time. And uh, I just 
mostly most of all but any time of year i will smoke this it's pretty darn good all right i'm going to enjoy this bowl and that is my brief review of haunted bookshop cake i wish you all happy smokes